know this, the U.S. Navy just blew into the harbors of Japan with these ironclad sailing ships, coal-powered warships, and basically said, hey, would you like to open up your country for trade? Didn't really give them a choice, right? We need whaling stations, we need cap um, captured sailors returned to us, and we need international trans-Pacific trade going on. Um, issues that are still with us, I guess. Um, <laughs> Coal for the whaling ships being supplanted by oil. Now it is. And one of the things they did to impress the Japanese was they invited all these Japanese dignitaries on board Commodore Perry's flagship, the uh, Powhatan. And, and they did several things. They showed them all this stuff the marching band played, but then after dinner, the sailors put on a minstrel show. They got out banjos, guitars, triangles, fiddles, bones. This is all documented because Japanese artists painted it in great detail. And, um, and, and Commodore Perry said in his report, the music so impressed the Japanese um, dignitaries who were visiting, they had a little bit too much wine as well. And that may have influenced their uh, judgments. But they said, Japan and America, same heart. Right? So keep in mind the minstrel show and, and all its too. Um, but one of the first songs they played was Hikayun Butler has come to town and it goes there's Yaz and there's Aouz that you can join oh, right in on. Pick oh, up oh, on it real quick. Yeah. Hikayun <laughs> Butler's come to town. <laughs> Coming, coming, 